as soon as you look at this question, what do you think? What should be the first step? I didn't that right. Solve LHS with I. Solving LHS and uh, you can directly apply converting into sign cost or identities. So I would say first apply identity, yeah. then sign and cost. Uh, okay. Don't do reverse. Mm -hmm. The question will become in fraction and we will get confused. So identity. Okay. Sign square A plus cross x square a plus 2 sin a multiply by cross x a. This is the first bracket. Mm -hmm. Similarly, for the second bracket, see, wow. if, if this was minus now, then I would have put a bracket, bigger bracket, so that it changes the sign. Right now, it's a plus, so I'm not bothered right now. Is that thing clear? Cos square a plus six square a plus two cos a multiply by stake a. Now I will change the sign in sine and cos. So the first number is already sine. Mm -hmm. We have cos also. Yeah, so cos will just switch one. So it is one. Understood? Yes, sir. Now, second number is in cosec. cosec. So do we know uh, cosec square a and sec square a? I don't think so. that's an identity. No. Okay, so I will convert that into sine and cos. So it oh. will become one upon sine square. A. Sine square. A. To sign a upon upon sign a, okay. Oh, okay. this this will become one upon sign mm -hmm. a. Yeah. Thus, sec will become one upon cos square a and plus sec. two cos a upon oh, sec. Okay. Cos Okay. Mm. See, sec become one upon cos. Yes. And this sec become one upon cos. Okay. Now, now cancel cos. Cos cos cancel. Mm. Now what is remaining? One, one plus, plus one plus sine square a. Wait, 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 wait. So one plus two plus two. So what happened over oh, here? Five. Uh, five. Five plus plus one by sine square a. One plus sine square a plus plus one, one by cos one square a. Yeah. The so obvious thing is we should take uh LCM. But if you see over here, seven is already here in the question, and I need to go into ten and cot. Yes or no? Yes, so first sir. of all, I would like to go in the numerator. Back to the numerator. Sorry, I'm taking a longer route. But that's how my child brain works. I should not take LCM. Reason being, question is saying it should be in square. And Very secondly, ten and cot. Secondly, mm. I need a number seven. seven. I'm already at five. So yeah. definitely some identity will be uh, we will be applying and we will uh, get the answer. I'll show you. One upon uh, sign again will go back to the numerator, will become cosec. Okay. I know it's taking a longer route, but once you know it, you can skip this step. Okay. Oh, okay. But Currently, uh, I would say just try to understand what I'm thinking because different questions will help you. Oh, so, okay. Where am I? Yeah. So one upon sine will give me 
परसेंट स्क्वायर है नॉट कॉस परसेंट 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 स्क्वायर है एंड दिस विल बी नेम प्लस हेड स्क्वायर है नाउ आइडेंटिटीज सो वी हैव थ्री आइडेंटिटीज साइन स्क्वायर है क्वेरी This is yes. So so instead of cosec, can I write cosec cosec as one plus cot square? Wait. Uh, if you shift it to that if side. Oh, oh, okay, 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 okay. Yes, sir. Understood. Uh huh. Similarly, can I shift? Uh, can Same. I write tan sec as Uh, one plus tan squared. So if I just add this five plus one plus one. स्क्वेर I'll use identity. Yes or no? Uh, I'll try to convert into sine and cos. My questions will be longer than other videos also. Let me tell you. If you watch these questions with some other teacher, mm -hmm. they will do some short trick and get the answer directly. But I yeah. always try to think where will the student will get stuck? Mm -hmm. Will student be able to understand this thing? So ninety nine percent students. Stuck at these questions, so this is my procedure. That's how I think. So try to practice different questions, new questions. 